my god, I will never do a text reveal again, that took me so long. Hello and welcome everybody. Today I'm gonna show you how to make this house, which is very good for survival because it has very easy materials to get like snow and wood. So don't keep making this longer and let's start with the tutorial. Well, I will take this moment to tell you that if you like this video, I will really appreciate if you can give me a like and consider subscribing, that'll make me so happy. And also I made a channel in Spanish and I will really appreciate if you support me there as well. With that being said, let's start with the tutorial. Well, to start we have to make the base and for that we're gonna take the snow block and we're gonna put six blocks in this line. One, two, three, four, five, six. Then we're gonna take the oak planks and we're gonna make this shape two blocks like this, three blocks like this, and this have to be one block after the line of snow. Then we're gonna take the snow, we're gonna put five blocks, three, four, five, then we're gonna make the same shape with the wood, and then we're gonna put two blocks of snow. Then we're gonna put nine blocks of snow, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Then we're gonna put this block of snow and then we're gonna make the same thing with it here but in this part so the same shape with wood five blocks with snow the same shape with oak planks and six blocks with snow one two three four five six it have to remain eight blocks right here so one two three four five six seven eight now that we have the layout of the house we're gonna make this two blocks tall so we're gonna take up all of these snow blocks, two blocks of tall. Once we have that done, we're gonna take the oak planks and we're gonna count 11 blocks tall. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So this wood is gonna be 12 blocks as such. Then we're gonna take up all of these wood shapes to the 11 blocks right here. Okay, now that we have that done, we can do the floor of the house. And for that we're gonna take the birch planks and we're gonna fill all of this up. So I'm gonna do it really fast. I told you that was gonna be so fast. So now that we have the floor, we're gonna count four blocks right here. One, two, three, four. Then in the five we're gonna put the block snow and in the six as well. And with this we're gonna make the same thing with it for the floor but right here. So I'm gonna do it uh, really fast. There we go, we have to be something like this. And now to finish the structure of the house, we're gonna do the roof and for that, we're gonna take the snow block, we're gonna take this one block out of the wood and we're gonna cover this up for all the sides of the wood. But here in this part, which is larger than the other parts, we're gonna take this out two blocks. Then we're gonna take this to here, we're gonna make this two blocks taller and we're gonna fill all of this up with two blocks taller. So I'm gonna do it really fast. I told you that that's gonna be so fast. Okay, so here we have all of our structure completely done. Yes, like that, simply. Now we're gonna do some detail. For that we're gonna take the dark oak trapdoors and we're gonna do this detail like it's a frame of our windows and that looks really amazing. And not because I did it, because let's be honest, it looks very amazing. We're gonna break the grass and we're gonna put the oak tractors right here and we're gonna do the same thing right here as well in the top. We're gonna break these blocks, we're gonna put the dark oak trapdoors and then we're gonna put the dark oak trapdoors in the walls. And we're gonna do the same thing with it here, right here as well. So this is it. And as you can see, this really looks like this is the frame of the window. And you have to make sure that the dark oak trapdoors, it's at the final or at the limit of the wood blocks. And we're gonna make the same thing with it here, right here as well, in all of our windows. So we're gonna break the floor right here. We're gonna put the trapdoors. We're gonna break the roof right here. And we're gonna put the trapdoors. We're gonna put the trapdoors right here, you got me. And we're gonna do the same thing with it here, right here as well, right here as well, here as well, right here as well, right here as well, here as well. And here no, because it is, no, I'm lying, here as well. So there we go, we have all of our frames in position and that looks fantastic but you really have to make sure that the frames are in the limit of the wood part because if it doesn't the house is gonna blow and if you don't believe me see for yourself I told you. That's why you have to make sure that this is on the limit. I gotta make the house right from the start. Even the model 
and the house that I did for the Spanish tutorial, I have to make both right from the start. Okay, if you thought with all of these dark oak trapdoors we are done, you were very wrong. We still need a lot of them. So I advise you, you have to be calm and take a lot of dark oak planks. If you wanna make the house, you will need a lot of dark oak trapdoors. We're gonna use the dark oak trapdoors now to do the balcony and for that we're gonna put trapdoors in the second block but in the bottom. We're not put them like this because we're gonna use this gap right here, put this block right here and the iron bars. So let's gonna do this bastante rápido. Okay, here we have the front part which look like this and now we're gonna do the rear part. Okay, so there we go and we have for the house itself all of the dark oak trapdoors done. But you still need them to do the decoration. So now we're gonna take the black stone walls to do some detail. We're gonna put them in this windows right here, leaving one block here, one block here. And we're gonna take this up to the end of our ceiling. And that looks like we have to divide our window in three parts. And that just looks amazing. We have to do this thing right here in this part as well. Doing one block, boom, one block, boom. We're gonna take this up. There you go. And we are gonna do the same thing for all of our windows, even here. We're gonna count one, two. We're gonna put the blackstone wall right here. We're gonna count one, two. We're gonna put our blackstone here. And it have to remain two blocks right here. And we're gonna take this up to the ceiling like this. And we're gonna make the same thing with it here in all of the windows here, there, and there. So there we go. We have all of our frames of our windows completely done. It just remains to do the glass part. But first, we're gonna get rid of the blackstone walls. So we're gonna put them in the corners of the snows, like if it were some iron columns. Yes, we have some iron columns in their house. You have to look something like this and we're gonna do the same thing for the balconies as well boom pam and clam with all of that done we have all of the blackstone wall part completely finished now we have to do the glass so we're gonna take the glass blocks we're gonna get at the inside of the house and we're gonna put them right here just in this snow part like so why glass block because why not now seriously why not because i think like that look better and we're gonna put the glass as well right here just next to the frame of the windows so there we go ladies and gentlemen we have all of the window part done and in all of the axes that we have right here we have to leave a hole of two blocks by two blocks because well minecraft doesn't have better doors than these ones so we're gonna put some doors right here in all of these parts now we have to do the little stay right here because like this is not gonna work so we're gonna do block four layers block four layers of no and there we have our stair so there we go my friends we have most of our house completely done now it only remains to do the decoration the light and the stairs for the stairs first we have to do a hole right here which is gonna take the five blocks of our windows and two blocks more like this and then we're gonna fill all of the snow that remains here with glass and that's gonna make us like a glass window that comes from the ceiling to the floor then we're gonna put the stair another stair another stair another stair and here we're gonna put a slab like this and the slab like this we're gonna get rid of these blocks and then we're gonna finish with two stairs and i'm not going doing this because that looks so big so i think this looks better and there we have our stairs we're gonna go up here turn and go here so there you have the stair now you can put some iron bars right here to make it a little bit cooler i know this can be a little bit expensive but well this is not supposed to be the base starting house i made this house to be like the second house you make after the dirt one you know speaking about bases actually in my first video which i will leave the link in the description i show you how to make a really easy started base which have uh, very easy materials like cobblestone and wood and you should like that video you won't regret and then for the lightning you just will put the lights where they fit pretty nice you know in the places where you think they look really cool and 
just have to make sure that they light the house up very nice so it's not that complicated and for the decoration I will show you the model house we go upstairs and here we have some plants which I made with flower pots, dead bushes and some leaves in the top and I really like this detail so I put them in all of the facades of the house in all of the corners and also in the interior of the house in all of the corners as well and that will look really cool because it brings a lot of life to the house and also you can make like this with some of leaves some of grass and that'll look really cool for the interior we go into the house and we have here this place where I have some ba barrels I don't know how to pronounce them some furnaces you know this can be the furnaces you want some sheds and you have to put some carpets over them because if you put that carpets over them you can open the sheds without problems some crafting tables and some chains to make this look like it's hanging from the ceiling also you can put a chest at the bottom of the stair you can also put some tables with some flowers as well that look real cool etc etc and here we have our stair to go up and you also can do here a stair to go down of the house to have like a chest area or storage area something like that as well and we go upstairs and here we have the second floor so here we have a I forgot the name of this you have this protection to don't fall down and this look really cool with the lights also we have a chest right here and here we have the bedroom which I really love you know with the trick of the carpets that look really cool and three beds to choose which one you're gonna sleep on and my favorite detail is that behind of the beds you have an ender chest and a double chest and that just looks absolutely fantastic then we have here this little chairs that look really cool in this spot and well I will eventually upload videos of how to make these the kind of decorations that we have in the house so don't worry another thing you can do with the house is to put black carpet on the roof of the house because that will look like it's a really cool line black line over the house that I really like but that's optional so well that is it this is a tutorial of how to make this really cool house I hope you like this video and remember if you do give me a like please you can subscribe as well and also I will leave the link in the description of my Spanish channel and I will really like if you support me there as well so that was the video I hope you like it and I'll see you in the next video. Ciao.